Hi, Beth Myers here. I'm starting this video as I drive home from Whole Foods. I just had dragon boat practice this morning and a few of us went to breakfast afterwards and we are, we're talking about a ketogenic diet and um, my friend suggested that I start some sort of Facebook page or blog or something because I've been doing some research for the last few months. I actually went ketogenic um, in the middle of July of 2017 and um, have been doing some research. I'm so consumed with this and the research uh, on ketosis and the benefits of it and I'm seeing anecdotal results with myself. I've lost um, a significant amount of weight, 15 to 18 pounds depending on um, which day and I'm a little um, in over two months into it. And I have a lot of information in my mind. It's not super organized, but it's fairly organized. And I was able to answer some questions of, from my friends. So they made the suggestion that I put together a resource for internal reference, and that's why I'm doing this. So um, doing this, starting this video just occurred to me driving home from Whole Foods. Um, Whole Foods is, is not cheap, but I do try to um, eat organic. Um, eat humanely raised um, meat, um, animals that are certified humanely raised to the best of my ability um, when I have that control. Um, I'm trying to do what the um, resources have um, told me and that is to try to purchase uh, grass fed beef when possible and um, just because of all the benefits um, from it and um, I'm just going to continue this recording when I get home and start unpacking some of the things from my store list. People had asked for um, to see my store list when we were at breakfast, so I thought, well, that's kind of interesting, isn't it? And um, I just jotted a few things down. We just got back from a big race. We, race. Uh, we actually raced, my Dragon Boat team um, got a bronze medal at the USDBA uh, Dragon Boat National Finals, I guess is a championship um, for the women's team, uh, women's premier team, and I was part of that, so very stoked. Um, but anyway, I had just scribbled a few things down right before I left on my trip that, for things that I needed, because interestingly enough, I had to write down a lot of the um, staples that I try to keep in the house um, because uh, we had, I had just evacuated my condo for Hurricane Irma the weekend before our trip. It was very hectic, and I had to evacuate because I live on a little island, and we are fortunate. I'm thanking you, God, um, any powers that be, positive energy. Thank you, everyone that I know that actually said prayers, positive thoughts, um, anything that you did that actually um, produced this favorable um, output for us. I feel very blessed and I'm very worried and concerned about um, my friends and my friends with family in Puerto Rico um, due to um, her, the, I believe it was, was it Maria um, that just hit there. Um, I had a little bit of impact from Jose when I was in um, New York, New Jersey area, but it was just minimal. So I'm um, thanking my lucky stars that my personal impact from those storms has been minimal. But looking forward to finding out what I can do to help my brothers and sisters, um, Puerto Rico uh, inhabitants there, and my friends whose family um, are there as well. But anyway, back to the uh, situation at hand. Sorry for rambling on. I've never done one of these. Um, but I'm really anxious to use this video as a starting point for some of my friends that might be interested in hearing um, why I went ketogenic, um, how it's working for me, my experience with um, the side effects of going keto, um, going through the experiencing the keto flu, um, what I did, what I do before practices, um, because our, we do some really high intensity kind of practices. Um, I also want to make sure that my friends that are endurance um, runners and bicycle riders and um, swimmers um, have some direction on 
uh, where to go to get their information. This is in no way, shape, or form implying that I'm an expert. I am extremely, extremely interested in becoming an expert in this. I actually, um, for those of you that don't know me or don't know me well, I'm a registered nurse and I am so intrigued by what I'm learning about um, ketosis and the benefits of it for everyday people as well as people with clinical issues um, that it can impact that I am actually extremely serious about um, getting my master's degree in nutrition and um, wellness. So um, I have a lot of health and wellness background um, in my nursing and healthcare experience and um, I just really feel like this is not a magic bullet but it really is um, much better solution for our issues with uh, obesity, um, everyone being overweight, not everyone, but the vast majority of adults, um, they're developing insulin resistance. We all are pretty much. When you read about this more with the resources that I'm going to reference, you're going to be shocked. And the purpose of me doing this is really just to give information for individuals to become informed consumers. I am no way, shape, or form uh, uh, trying to say that I am right. I feel that this is the right direction for a lot of people, and I want them to research the things, the resources that I have identified, um, take some of these um, facts, apply them to your own lives and um, see how you feel about it. Come to your own conclusions. Um, but I, I feel that this, that we have been lied to. I feel that the research, um, the things I was taught in school from my dietetics courses to anatomy and physiology to nutrition um, to the American Heart Association, the American College of Cardiology, someone somewhere is really drinking some Kool-Aid with a lot of sugar in it, um, with a lot of carbohydrates in it. Um, big business runs this country as we know. Um, don't even get me started on healthcare reform or anything of that nature. Um, I have so much to say. Maybe this is me starting a process of being the person that I really want to be, being my best self, and I'm really anxious and I appreciate my friends um, making a suggestion that I even try. Because you don't know until you try, right? So anyway, um, stay tuned for more information. Thanks so much.